So, Mags, man of the match performance, a goal, centre midfield role, uh, and a crazy win. Can you unpack that for us? I mean, like, first of all, obviously, when I heard I was going to play midfield from the gaff, I was buzzing because obviously I was like, I've always said, like, it's something that I feel like if I just, I can try it. And I've always wanted to try it and see how I do, like, obviously, playing 90 minutes there. Um, so I was thankful for that. Obviously, it shows how much, like, belief he has in me to just say, all right, cool, put you in midfield then. So, thankful for that, obviously, and, and yeah, just the goal was, I said to Smarty, he basically made the goal for me because I think he's probably run 50 metres full pace just to, like, um, distract their, their centre-back. And it's given me, obviously, the chance to, to go and score. So, that's <laughs> unreal from, from him. And he's been amazing in training, so um, yeah, he deserved he deserved to start and play. And obviously, buzzing that Danny, who's obviously bit, maybe been a bit disappointed because he ain't playing as much as, as much as he'd like. But against um, Dagenham and Redbridge, he scored the winner today. He scored the winner. Um, been training well. Like it's just just it's it feels good, obviously, to know that people who maybe ain't been involved as much are still out here giving their best for everyone so it just goes to show how much of a team we are and how close we are and how much everyone wants to work for each other so it's that's the that's the main thing for me yeah yeah absolutely and so you said you were you're quite excited to, to play in that midfield role yeah. how did it feel out there for the like you said the full 90 minutes oh, it was a blow to be honest it's it tiring because obviously i'm not used to obviously you're just constantly moving moving and obviously going 10 um going down to 10 men it um, makes it even more difficult because you've got to do extra running. So, um, yeah, no, but everyone's got, we've all got it in us to, to dig in and grind more for each other. And that's just what we've done so many times this season. And even 10 men, 2-2, two, two, 90th minute with two minutes to go, like, we still got it in us to go and score winners. So it's, yeah, it just... It, it's really good and it, it's, it basically sums up everything that um, we've showed this season. Just hard work and determination, never giving up, all those things. And it's so important. At the end of the season, they'll hopefully, um, you know, mean something. And But if you look at maybe seasons in general, um, when you don't have those things, that foundation of hard work and all that sort of stuff, you don't re you generally don't do well but at least because we've got that foundation um it, it just means that we're giving us the giving ourselves the best chance um to get the best result at the end of the season which is obviously promotion generally yeah uh, you mentioned briefly there obviously the red card how was the the feeling in the dressing room at half time obviously one nil up going in well but yeah. down to 10 men yeah. uh, you bounced straight back in the second half but yeah. what was the thought like amongst the lads just um, don't get too like frustrated or angry at any decisions being made against us or just basically just keep our heads on the game and fighting for each other and that's it um, our, our, our thing was we're 1-0 up so we keep the score the same we win the game um, obviously football doesn't work like that always um, but then like, like I say the character to set back we'll go ahead again we'll score another goal set back and then to go again, like it's, that's that's like I say, the main thing for me is just how shows how big our character is as a team. Um, so yeah. Yeah. The next big moment was obviously your goal. Um, talk us through. You mentioned obviously how big a part Smart had yeah, to play, but yeah. the composure from yourself as well to finish it and yeah. the celebrations. Yeah, yeah, I know. I mean, yeah. Well, as soon as it opened up for me, my eyes just lit up and I heard Smarty because Smarty was calling for it, and then. When like it basically opened up for me, he was like, "I'll oh, shoot then." <laughs> and I was like, "Yeah, go on then." Um, it's similar to like in terms of the finish, like to the Folkestone one, um, and yeah, it was just obviously when it goes in, just everyone's buzzing, I'm buzzing, fans were amazing down there, um, obviously for the celebration. So yeah, it's an amazing feeling that like yeah, just it's why you love football at the end of the day. Do you know what I mean? So it was good, really good. Yeah, absolutely. And, and despite the setback, the scenes at full time as well kind of were, were similar as well. Yeah. How good was that as a, you know, as a player on the pitch to, to have that you know, rush of emotion at full mm. time and to be involved with the fans yeah. too? Yeah, uh, we were saying in there, me and Boise were saying how the game was just full of, just a roller coaster of emotions. Like, obviously, you go one nil up. Maybe probably after, like, we didn't, we weren't amazing, like, in the first 30 minutes or a bit, 
kind of edgy and then go one nil up and then 10 men and then 2 nil and then 2-2. Two, two. Like, it's so many, like, ups and downs throughout the match. And obviously winning at the end, it was just like, just like an explosion of everything that, has, that had happened. But we deserved it, like, we deserved it because of the work we put in. So, yeah, I, I don't think they would go back home and be like, they got robbed. And if they do, they're lying. So, like, we deserved it. We worked hard. We worked on um, very hard, so yeah, um, it was good. It was good. Yeah, absolutely. And, and uh, how important is a, a win like this to start the year? And, and can we take it into next week with a, with a tough away game? Uh, yeah, no, was, we got we got quite a tough run of fixtures now in terms of away games. So yeah, just another test. Obviously, um, we're confident that we can get results. Um, yeah, I think like we've done all season, we can go and upset the teams. Um, away um, I think obviously our away form isn't as good as our home form but that's something that now we have the, uh, the chance to like rectify because we've got a lot of away games in the next few uh, in the next few weeks so we can we can change that and all of a sudden our away form can, can look really good so it's a great opportunity for us to, to make our away form really good and then obviously whenever we do play at home to keep the keep the solid home form and keep, keep winning here yeah, absolutely. And, and, and lastly, then, I suppose, I'm sure the period of your initial time here is, is due to be over soon. Mm. How have you enjoyed it? And, you know, mm. is it something that you'd look to hopefully kind of end the season with us? Maybe? Yeah, I mean, I said, I said to the gaffer, it's been amazing. Um, obviously, last season was very, very difficult for me not playing. But I said to, to him, um, like, how much I appreciate just, like, the confidence he's put in me and the time and all of that stuff to kind of just let me like work it out for myself. Um, and I think, yeah, it's, 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 it's been really enjoyable for me because I, I, I love the lads and we all get on really well. Like training's top quality. Um, we are getting good results. But I've been playing like, it's just, it's enjoyable for me because obviously last season was tough football wise and it kind of, I wouldn't say fall out of love with it, but it's you don't really when you're like when it's like that, it's it's just not easy. It's hard um, um, when you're not, I guess, as appreciated as as you have been or had been before. Um, but now it's it's really good because yeah, I'm, I'm, I feel appreciated and it's obviously a good feeling. Do you know what I mean? So and to end it to end it off here, yeah, I said to Gaff, of course, like that the best case in terms of like being here and helping us get promotion and next season being in the league and whatnot, like that'd be amazing if I could be a part of that. Um, I think like anyone in there, especially around my age or younger, if obviously a very good offer came from, I don't know, another club, you'd, you'd have to think about it, do you know what I mean? So, um, but at the same time, I'm not thinking too much or not thinking at all, honestly, about leaving because I'm, I'm enjoying my time here. Like I'm happy here, so um, yeah, I, it hasn't really come into my head. Um, I said to Gaffer, listen, I just want to play. I'm not really thinking about that because it just becomes a distraction. So yeah, um, as long as as long as as long as obviously it's, it's good for everyone, and everyone's happy, which I think everyone is, then I don't see why it should change. So yeah, it's good. Perfect. Great to hear, and, and well done today, mate. Well done. Perfect. Thank you very much.